hi guys welcome you again to today's news still on the issue of the 2023 presidency i'm sure when you hear the word 2023 presidency you might be you know doubting what probably could have happened again now as it stands there's a huge trouble for tinubu guess what Gandhi now assures Lawan of full cooperation. Gandhiji, the governor of Kano State, now saying is in support of Ahmed Lawan in the 2023 presidency. And now Tinubu is probably losing some supporters because people you see and you say, okay, I'm sure this person will support Tinubu. These are the same people. Who are turning their back against Tinubu endorsing another presidential candidate well let's see the full gist in the news if you are coming across this channel for the very first time want to say big welcome to you to those who watch and leave to subscribe to this channel and don't forget to turn on the bell icon to get you notified anytime we post a new update and a big shout out to our existing subscribers we want to say big thank you for always checking back at this channel to view the news let us say big thank you for liking for sharing for even commenting let us say big thank you to you and um you know encouraging you to continue and as you do that the lord bless you now to the full gist of today's news the governor of kano state dr abdullahi Gandhiji, has assured the senate president ahmed lawa of full cooperation over his ambition to stand as the flag bearer of the All Progressive Congress (APC) in the 2023 presidential election. Governor Gandhiji described Kano State as a swing state in the party primaries and even in presidential elections, and declared that Kano State will swing when it is ready to swing. He spoke on Saturday night while Lawan was on a visit to see the party delegates in Kano ahead of the upcoming presidential primaries of the All Progressive Congress APC scheduled for the end of this month. Lawan and his campaign team were received at the Aminu Kano International Airport by Ganduji himself amidst a mammoth crowd of party supporters who thronged the airport and route with fun fair to welcome them to the Asian city. In his welcome remarks, Governor Gandhiji said the people of Kano were aware of Lawan Stalin qualities and his contributions to the stability of politics and governance in the country the governor said from Laos antecedents he if he wins or won the presidency of nigeria there would be peace and stability in both politics and in governance gandhiji told lawa your excellency i want to inform you that we are fully aware of your capacity we are fully aware the way you handle the National Assembly, the House of Representatives, and the Senate, which you are the chairman. If we can recall with, you know, nostalgia, what happened between 2015 and 2019, we are all living witnesses that we had a lot of instability, poor relationship between the legislator, you know, the legislature and the executive. In fact, we had a situation where in one day 15 senators from APC defected to PDP from the Senate chamber. Your Excellency, I am saying all these things in order to show your political dexterity in managing the National Assembly, in managing the relationship between the executive and the legislature. Today, there is peace. For their relationship between the executive and the legislature and we believe if you become the president of the federal republic of nigeria we can expect peace and stability between the legislature 
and the executive with the institutions of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, with the subnational government in the states, with the local governments. So, Your Excellency, we assure you of our full cooperation. Kano State is a swing state. In the presidential primaries, even in the presidential election, and Kano State will swing when it is time to swing. Kanduji dwell in what made Kano as important in the political calculations of Nigeria. He said, Kano has the largest number of delegates in the country. There is no gain saying about that. This follows, you know, this follows, pardon, from the fact that we have the largest population in the country. So, Your Excellency, this state is a very important state when issues of elections are concerned. We have 44 local governments. We have 484 wards. All our local government council chairmen are elected local government chairmen. Therefore, they are expected, you know, they are part, pardon, of the statutory delegates in Kano State and in Nigeria. We have over 4,000 elected councillors in Kano State and most of our 400 legislators, especially House of Representatives, senators, former senators, principal officers of the State Assembly and National Assembly, Your Excellency, both of them, we are together and we are intact. So, you can see the composition of our delegates, not only in terms of number, but in terms of quality, in terms of capacity, in terms of capability, and in terms of political dexterity. Speaking on the forum which held at the Coronation Hall of Kano State Government House, Lawan said his mission was to interact with the party delegates on his presidential bid ahead of the primaries. I am here to see and interact with all the 500 delegates pardon, from Kano State, and I cannot agree more with my leader when he said that this is the largest subnational democracy in Nigeria. I imagine that it could also be the largest subnational democracy in Africa. When His Excellency, our governor, was rounding up speech, he said Kano is a swing state and it can determine not only the primaries with 500 delegates but also the general elections. Your Excellency, it will swing to my side by the grace of God. I want all the 500 delegates. In fact, I need all the 500 delegates, Your Excellency. If you can't have the 500, please let me have at least 400. That is what has been said. We can now see that there's a huge trouble now for Tinubu because people who ought to be supporting Tinubu or people who we all we thought could be supporting Tinubu are now the same people who are now supporting and endorsing someone else. We can see that Tinubu's presidential ambition now is now shaking. It's not standing firm as it used to stand. We would like you to let us know your own point of view to this. Don't forget that. There's trouble for Tinobu as Gandhiji assures Lawal of full cooperation still on the issue of the 2023 presidency. Thank you guys for listening. Subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.